characterizing oil using Aspen Hysis in order to model a produced oil and gas split a computer program must faithfully simulate the vapor liquid equilibrium and fluid property characteristics of the fluid there are various characterization method used to produce the vapor liquid equilibrium and fluid properties of oil in computer simulations the choice of method depends largely on the data available to the modeler which may be limited to simple field data or may include detailed lab analysis in this example samples were taken from test separator that produced both oil and gas as a result the lab analysis of the oil sample was done exclusive of light ends the oil assay include a true boiling point distillation curve and a bulk standard density so here we will add light components our components are water and from methane to an hexane the fluid package is bang robinson after a selection of a fluid package we will go to the home tab and select oil manager In the oil manager we have an input assay option click on the add button so here you can see the bulk properties so we choose used here and provide the standard density which is 56.1 pound per cubic feet there are different acid data type like true boiling point tbp astm d86 astm d1160 astm d86 dash d1160 astm d2887 chromatographic method the equilibrium flash vaporization So in our case we will choose TBP. Light ends are ignore here. So in the distillation we have S basis liquid volume. You have to provide at least 5 point to solve it. Click on edit assay. and provide at 0% it is 35 at 2% it is 78 at 5% it is 119 at 10% it is 167 at 15% it is 197 at 20% it is 238 at 30% it is 
थ्री जीरो नाइन एट फोर्टी परसेंट इट इज थ्री नाइन जीरो एट फिफ्टी परसेंट इट इज फोर डबल सेवन एट सिक्सटी परसेंट इट इज फाइव सिक्स एट एट सेवेंटी परसेंट इट इज फाइव सेवन थ्री एट एटी परसेंट इट इज एट जीरो नाइन एट नाइंटी परसेंट इट इज वन जीरो टू फोर फेरन हाइट एट नाइंटी फाइव परसेंट इट इज डबल वन नाइन वन एट नाइंटी एट परसेंट इट इज वन थ्री टू सेवन फेरन हाइट एंड एट हंड्रेड परसेंट इट इज वन फोर टू नाइन फेरन हाइट क्लिक ओके यू कैन सी द टेबल इज रेडी नाउ यू ओनली नीड टू क्लिक ऑन कैलकुलेट बटन so the assay was calculated you can see there these are the calculation default configuration the conversion methods in the working curve you can see the detail for the working curve in the plots you can see the plot data now you will click on output blend and click on the add button here you can see your assay and right hand side you can see the cut option when you are generating hypothetical component you have this cut option if you are choosing auto cut so in the range of 100 to 797 fahrenheit it will give you 28 cut four cut at every 100 fahrenheit from 797 to 1200 to fahrenheit it will give you eight cut two cut per 100 fahrenheit and from 1200 to 1600 fahrenheit it will give you total four cut one cut per 100 fahrenheit if you choose the other option the user point in the case of user point from initial boiling point to 797 fahrenheit it will give you four cuts per 100 fahrenheit from 797 to 1202 fahrenheit it will give you two cuts per 100 fahrenheit from 1202 fahrenheit to final boiling point it will give you one cut per 100 fahrenheit so in our case we will choose auto cut so it will provide you the cuts automatically click on the add button to add your essay so your essay is added and in this table you can see the hypothetical components are generated with their normal boiling point molecular weight and density and the viscosities these are the property plots like true boiling point ASTM D86, D86 crack reduced. So these all are the curves you can see there. So this is the distribution plot with the end temperatures, and this is the composition plot. 
Now if you click on install oil button, so you can give the name like crude oil and click on install button to install it in simulation environment. Click on simulation environment. So this is your crude oil with all the compositions. So you can see there. All the compositions are available. I hope you like this video. See you soon in the next video.